Hi, my name is Elodie Doiron. I'm lecturer in economics at SIS. I'm the convener for Topics in Microeconomics, which is an intermediate level course in microeconomics. It's building on the foundation that has been laid out in Introduction to Micro, which is uh, a compulsory prerequisite for uh, Topics in Micro. The course is um, theoretical, so the objective is to introduce you with all the tools you will need to uh, deal with more advanced applied courses in your final year. Uh, we are covering quite a lot of topics, it's a very dense course. Uh, we are covering uh, consumer choice, uh, labor supply, some basis of contract theory, a little bit of strategic games with auctions for example. And all of this is treated with intuitions and graphs, so it's quite important to have uh, basic mathematical skills that will allow you to interpret uh, functions, for example, so uh, analysis of functions is something that we do quite a lot. Um, we do also constraint optimization, so you need to master skills like differentiation, for example. Um, the course is so quite dense, quite uh, intensive. Um, we have two hours of lectures every week. It's also quite diverse in the topics we are covering. Uh, but to make it uh, a bit more interesting and a bit more applied, we try to uh, discuss current affairs and how uh, the tools developed in the course can be applied to understand a change in policy, for example. So in previous years, we've discussed how uh, a change in um, a threshold for um, the tax-free um, part of your income uh, was affecting uh, poor households or wealthier households more. So at the time, uh, the government who implemented that policy change was arguing that it was good for um, uh, poorest households, and we basically used uh, the tools of the course to show that it was actually not the case. Uh, we've been discussing things like changes in policies around um, free childcare provisions all other issues that you know, we can use the course and the tools developed in the course to understand the impact on households and people more generally. So looking forward to see you on the course.